Hello y'all, welcome back. Today we're looking at a 71 Cheyenne 4x4 K10. West Coast truck. This thing is for sale here at LaFontaine Classics. We want to show you all through this car and uh, get you as familiar as possible without you being here. Well, let's go at it. Kicking us off right up front, I'm gonna pop this hood for you and show you what's cooking out of this K10. We got a nice 350 V8. We got, uh, we've had a ton of maintenance done to this thing. There's a lot, a lot of receipts with it. I really, uh, I really like when we get to own a vehicle after the type of person that logs everything, keeps track of it all, and has all of those receipts and whatever this truck needed, it certainly got. Um, got a new battery in here on top of that 350. Looks like a carb, but that's actually a Holley Sniper EFI carb on there or throttle body. So you don't got to pedal this thing up or worry about flooding plugs. It's spot on every time. It's got power brakes, um, disc in the front, drum in the rear, just like it was new. We've got power steering down low. And this is our surge tank for that Holley Sniper EFI kit. Um, this takes the drivability up so many notches having this EFI on here. Dig it, love it. Everything else under here is good and solid. Um, this is like a, a super, super nice truck you want to drive, use, enjoy. It's got a couple of rock chips, things here or there. I don't think it faults it at all because it's so solid. It's been a West Coast truck. There's no rot anywhere. The cab corners, the rockers, this thing's clean. Now, while we're peeking in here, I want to mention to you guys, it's got a brand new steering box, brand new Bilstein shocks, um, stabilizer bar, um, tie rods, the list goes on. And then out here, some of that sex appeal, these brand new BF Goodrich all-terrain TAs. Um, locking front hubs, they got the, the rally wheel painted black behind there. That gives it a killer look. And some more candy for you. Don't see too many Cheyenne or Super Cheyenne 4x4s. We got one here. I love it, dig it. Again, this thing's straight. I'm gonna show you this door opening. Does everything just like it's supposed to. Clean as a whistle. Super, super clean. Original Vintag, factory rivets all on there. They've done a nice job. Show you guys this closing up. Tight like a glove. Now we got a fill neck for our first tank right in the cab. And then you come down this straight little bedside and we have the fill for the dual tank, the second one in the back here. So you can go on a road trip, you can travel quite far. Um, another cool option, something that you'd see in a Super Cheyenne, badass. Um, come back here, got the wood grain, both lines of trim. Bumper looks very good and straight. Got a nice piece of stainless steel on this tailgate. Um, everywhere here looks very solid. This is a spray in liner, um, you know, Raptor liner, Line X, something of the sort, holding up quite well. We've got our big pane of glass in the back with that cargo lamp, all good stuff. Sweet. Um, coming down this side, again, all our trims here and intact. There's a little dent or a bruise here or there, but again, I don't think it takes away from this one. It's shows very well, the paint shines, but it, you know, it's got a rock chip or two. It's something you could take down a, a two track if you wanted to, go camping, hunting, whatever it be, and not have to sweat about dirtying up your truck. This is very, very functional. Look at those jams, the cab corners, all very clean. You notice the door seals are new, um, along with a whole bunch of other stuff on this truck. Dig it, dig it, and check this out. It closes up really tight. Got the slick little mirrors on here. Not too big, just the right amount. And then some more of that Cheyenne badging. Some clean little wheel wells. Those Bilsteins, this thing rides smooth. We're gonna get a video going down the road. Um, I will, I will attest to it. They are, they're definitely an upgrade over the stock, those Bilsteins. Um, and then up on this side here, very straight, 
clean, everything fits well. All our trim is here. The uh, little bits of chrome over these lights, everything's good to go. Uh, stainless wipers, a windshield that's free and clear of any chips. Keeps getting better. All right, I'm gonna fire it up, get us some clips, show us a few things in the truck, and then we're going to hit the road. So we're inside the Super Cheyenne here. We've got uh, quite a few things happening. Um, one thing you'll notice, you probably don't see in most of these trucks, this is the uh, a unit that comes with that Holly EFI kit. Uh, I'm letting you know your air to fuel ratio, a couple other vitals. Um, I believe you can even see a fuel table on there. Um, cool stuff, it is a self-learning piece. You probably never have to touch it, but it is there. Um, I'll show you this you'll hear that electric fuel pump come on no more mechanical notice no pumping of the gas like clockwork um, one thing with this being a super giant we get this lovely headliner with all the nice trim we get the shoulder belts um, what else like I said cargo lamp real nice little seat here and in case you haven't figured it out I think I've said it a hundred times this is a 4x4 so a real grab them and go we're in too high now we know it all does work and good news i've got receipts and everything for it transmission was just rebuilt and the transfer case was just rebuilt as well um, lots of good stuff going for this thing definitely a turnkey piece now we shall turn the radio on oh yeah that's working good and we'll hit the road can definitely get out of its way. Well, it takes the bumps very well. Um, I notice all of the gauges are working good. Battery, oil pressure, um, our speedo, coolant temp, all good stuff. And with that fuel injection kit, no skip of a beat, no hesitation at our Power disc brakes, stop this thing on a dime. Steering wheel stays straight too. I got our blinker on, this light's flashing at me. Let's see if it clicks off like it's supposed to. It sure does. Very healthy 350 under here. It's got those, uh, those long tube headers on to help waking it up. With the fuel injection kit, definitely makes plenty of power to move this big old truck. To another stop here pedal feels good um, wheel feels good those rotors are definitely smooth um, I mentioned it earlier West Coast truck lots of receipts with it um, definitely been cared for lots of good service done I'm probably leaving a few things out but we will have a link below this video where you can go and see all that good information on our website and a whole bunch of pictures, get you the undercarriage, all that wonderful stuff. Through this way, the road opens up here and I'm gonna open this 350 up here. How about that? Take a peek at the steering wheel here. These brakes are tidy. The alignment is right. Coming to a stop. This wheel ain't move. The truck's pointed the way we started here. Love to see it. And a little bit of giddy up. Love it, love it.
love it, love it. Yeah, this is a tight old truck with uh, pretty much everything you'd ever want on it. You could daily drive this thing. I'd take it across the country if I had to and wouldn't look back. Fuel injection, you know you can count on it. Good old GM truck. If you need any parts for these things, they're easy to get. And uh, like I mentioned, trans just rebuilt, transfer case redone, new steering box. And um, I know it's got a new rear main seal in it, um, oil pan, trans pan gasket. The list goes on. All right, we're gonna head it back to the shop now. See you in a sec. All right, got it up in the air. Gonna take a look underneath, um, right up front here. We got a nice aftermarket stabilizer bar. Bill Steam absorber helping you out here. Absorbs those bumps at high speeds, keeps the wheel straight. We got a brand new steering box up there, like I mentioned. Um, bunch of bushings on this truck are new. You look under there at the oil pan, trans pan, that all looks brand new because it was just rebuilt. Um, all dry, of course. We've got a 208 four wheel transfer case here. This is freshly rebuilt as well. We got the receipts and everything for that. We got a lovely, lovely uh, aluminized steel dual exhaust going all the way back with Flowmaster mufflers. I see a new drive shaft. See some more new looking Bilsteins. And this truck, like I said earlier, has those dual tanks. One behind the cab, and then the other right up under the bed. And we got two stainless downturns, beautiful muffler, very, very solid truck. Cool. Guys, thank you for tuning in with us here. Um, it's been my pleasure. I had a great time driving this truck. I uh, love the combination. This is gonna make a really great truck for someone. And one thing too I thought I should mention, the previous owner had a three-year ceramic coat done. Uh, if you don't know what that is, it pretty much makes the surface of this paint like glass. So if you get it dirty, it just hoses off and it shines again. Really cool thing. Thought I should mention that. Um, and then also, the number to dial us if you're interested, want to know more, want to know about shipping, finance, or whatever it be, is going to be 248 714 2110. And lastly, I'm going on, if you want to see all of our pictures, the underside, the full write up, we're going to link the listing to our website here uh, in the description of the video below. Thank you. Get out of here before this train comes. See you guys.